Welcome, Carrie. I am thrilled to have you as our design partner for Westlake Royal Stone Solutions and our brands, Eldorado Stone, Cultured Stone, and Kindred Outdoors and Surrounds. Thank you so much for joining us here in beautiful Napa Valley. I am excited to see what we are doing today. I have always been a huge fan of your work, and I know that you've worked with our products for many years, and I, I am so excited to just really dive into this experiential you know, opportunity that you've laid out for us. Yeah, well, it's an honor to be here with you in one of my favorite places. Great to have you in the Napa Valley. And to be a design partner of yours, having used your product for so many years and really having it be part of the show that we share with our clients. And so having you here is really special. And we are, we are just so honored to have you really do this beautiful tablescape for us. And I can't wait to really get into the details of this. But before we do, I would love to learn more about you as a designer. Yeah, well, I've been a residential interior designer for 27 years and using your product for over 20 years. So with that, um, after graduating from Cal Poly in San Luis Obispo, I worked for Ralph Lauren, which has been a big influence in my life. And some you'll see some little elements of that still here today. Um, and then also working in the production home building field and then having my own design firm, which we've gone into many homes and built them from the ground up and renovated and done all the things. So it's it's exciting to be a part of this industry and share some of the trends along the way Yeah, um, that as we research them and also share them with the design community. I'd love to show you what we have here for you today. So let's start with the blues. I mean, even this tile here that we would use in a kitchen or a bathroom, we're seeing all different shades of it, but we're also seeing matte finishes and we're seeing shiny finishes or right. glossy finishes. And similar to a lot of the product that you're creating, those handmade details mm -hmm. are really important or those maker details. Little character details. Yep. Yeah. Give that authenticity, that grounding effect within the home. Also, we're seeing all of these elements be paired with brushed brass and brushed elements for not only a beautiful aesthetic, but also low maintenance. So we don't see any of those scratches oh, or anything. little fingerprints. Or yeah, like absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely right. And often we're asked, what can I do just to zhuzh my mm -hmm. house? And mm -hmm. with that, we're doing details that um, can just be thrown into a bowl or even open on a book, maybe paired with something from your travels in a bookcase yeah. or on a coffee table. Yeah. And incorporating these, again, sustainable looking right. or biophilic elements that have the natural details such as jute. Right. Can you see that, putting that in your home? I any of it? I would take <laughs> any of this and actually put it anywhere I could in my house. What I So walk me through too, because what's interesting is I love to see the colors go from this color palette to the next one, to mm -hmm. the next one. But when looking at how you place kind of our product in here, it also feels like you could mix and match and move Absolutely. different products to different color palettes. Um, working with Stone Veneer over the years and our product specifically, have you noticed the versatility of mm -hmm. being able to kind of Mix and match. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. absolutely. And even having stones that complement each other, I like to set the tone for our curb appeal of something on that exterior stone. And then maybe you go into a courtyard and then maybe the next space is something like a fireplace wall. Right. Um, or a feature wall. Right. Um, and then have it translate all the way through to the back of the house to maybe another fireplace or another exterior element. So mixing and matching is always a good idea yeah. for sure, especially with the Cultured Stone and Eldorado Stone product. And this palette, maybe being a little bit more colorful, we move in over here to maybe some neutrals. Right. And trend-wise, we're seeing a lot of contrast. Yeah. Are you seeing that black and white as we well? We are seeing the same thing, and I love the products that you paired with it. This has such a sophisticated, yeah. you know, luxurious type of feel, but I love kind of the texture that is brought out with some of the choices that you've picked here. And those are the type of details we're looking for. So on a leather sample that may be a little bit more polished and not quite have the hand that something like this mm -hmm. does, you're yeah. giving us the personality and the texture. I see. In, in uh, our stone there. So that's something that we definitely celebrate. And I think as you go through adding that stone element in, but then having something softer, right. like a velvet, mm -hmm. It doesn't feel masculine, it doesn't feel feminine. Right. It, everyone's included. And, right. and with the durability of the products, everyone's included age-wise too. You know, the three to 103 years old, right. everyone can come to the house and play and enjoy. 
And it creates such a great like juxtaposition between materials, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. when you have tension. such a tactile material and then you're pairing it with some of these other softer, um, you know, fabrics and whatnot. It is, it is so alluring. It is, I instantly am attracted to every single one of these. So what else do we have here that really is just kind of standing out to you in terms of design? Are there any, you know, singular trends that you're seeing or hot topics? You're a hot topic <laughs> right now. So, so the innovation and the new product, I think when we see something that is so classic and we're so used to red brick right. and you're turning it on its head by offering it in white and gray and right. this more of a charcoal tone, I think that is something that keeps looks fresh. I have been so excited for you <laughs> to get your eyes on some of the new products that we have coming out. And I'm so glad to see some of these incorporated in this tablescape because it really does bring me, you know, kind of butterflies in my stomach to really see where this could go, you yeah. know, in the future of design. So I love that. Well, we appreciate that you're listening to us <laughs> and, and you are providing products that make it fresh and new for us as well as our clients and they can feel like they're up to date, they're current, yet timeless at the same time. Right. This was so fun. I appreciate you coming and allowing me to share how your product blends so beautifully with all that we do. Carrie, this has been amazing. It has been extremely eye-opening and thank you so much for your time today. Mm -hmm.